Yes. Um, I have difficulty understanding how to incorporate these um, philosophies into my daily life. For instance, I may be in a situation at work that requires me to think clearly and react quickly, or I might be in a situation in my personal life that is very emotionally charged. And to me, it seems counterproductive to still my mind and relax my mind when I need to make decisions and mm -hmm. uh, react quickly. Yes, but we might look at it this way. The still mind can be very powerful. It is not only uh, relaxing to meditate, but it also gives us more clarity of mind. In the beginning meditation, you will find is mostly something that you experience as a relaxation practice. But once you meditate more often, more regularly, then you will find that it does more than that. It gives you a certain uh, inner stability. It gives you a certain uh, re resistance to outside forces. Uh, you could say it's a certain, um, don't know exactly the English word, but it's a certain uh, way to, to keep our inner freedom without being drawn with, to outside forces all the time. So for example, to come back to the example of the car that is cutting us off and we almost crush into another car and we become angry because of that. In, when you meditate, it doesn't always mean that you are not going to do something about it. Maybe you will step out of the car and say something to that person, but it will be more based on wisdom. It will be more based on understanding. It will be more based on peacefulness. Meditation doesn't always necessarily make us more passive. It simply can help us give more space for thought before we do something. So, uh, of course, it, it's possible that you do not uh, feel about meditation that way yet. But uh, do not forget that everything you are from, from the moment you, you have meditated for about half an hour or an hour onward, your entire being has already changed because our mind is, con is continuously affected by the practice of meditation. This is actually, uh, uh, has already been scientifically uh, proven. Where the way, as soon as we meditate for about half an hour, an hour, our mind is already affected for a long term. That sounds very scary, but it, it simply means that our mind is a bit more stable. <laughs> because we do not always, in meditation, we learn not to run after our sense impressions, right? So we hear something, we think something, we have memories. All of these thoughts, we learn to simply allow them to be. We do not always get distracted by our thoughts. We do not always run after our thoughts. We, we learn to gradually give more space to our thoughts and eventually our thoughts will not control us that much. When we realize that we, we still are able to think, we still will be able to think and we have to use our thinking in our daily lives, of course, but it will be thinking that is more based on wisdom and pause for thought. Don't know if this is answering your question? Yes. Okay.